Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of the Top 10 Polls of the Week. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you're having a great week. And if you're watching this with me live, hopefully you're going to have a good start to your weekend here. We haven't had any huge name products come out recently, so those really, really high dollar polls might be dwindling down. But we got some pretty good ones still for you here today. And the reactions are still great. doesn't matter if it's 500,000, 2,000. People still get excited when they pull a card like that. And that's what this is all about. So please make sure you support these guys. I got all the links to these polls in the description box below. So if you really like one, go check out some of these guys' other videos. Maybe you will end up liking this content creator. Um, but make sure you go ahead and like this video while you're at it as well. I know there's no football this weekend, so I'm curious, what are you guys up to? I'll probably be watching some Olympics. I'm going to try to go snowboarding this weekend. Um, but outside of that, not a lot. So let me know what you guys are up to this weekend. I don't really have anything else to say, so let's get into the polls this week. Kicking us off at number 10 this week, we have DP's Cards. Now, every box I've watched open, somebody at least got a base wander out of... Oh, really? I'm scared that we're going to be the first box. <laughs> we're the ones that don't. That there's no base. There's a... Oh! <gasps> you wished and it came true! <laughs> so, Baseball Stars, Wander Franco, Rookie Card Auto. I thought it looks like it's the gold. Yeah. Yep, out of 50. Out of 50. So, you don't have to work anymore. Yeah, I guess. A Wander Franco gold out of 50 auto. That's because you kept saying we're looking for him, and then there he was. Now, there's no sales yet on this card, but there is an out of 25 listed for $2,000 on eBay. So I'm putting this one at $1,700, but this is a massive pull. Wander Franco cards are going crazy, and this is the not the last time you'll see him today. At number nine this week, Let's we have Tony's Breaks. Uh, Julio Jones, Goff, Auto, Chargers... Can Justin Herbert auto? Oh shit, there you go. Whoa, one of one! Oh, what the f One of one, Herbie! Bro, this is my first one of one. I never, I didn't, I, well, I, whoa. Holy sh. I, I, whoa. Whoa. This is the exact reaction I would imagine I would have if I pull a 101. It will happen someday. It hasn't yet. And this is Tony's first 101, and he celebrated it accordingly. What a pull. I got this one at 1750. At number eight, we're going over to the pond to British football breaks. No way. No way. Did anyone? That's not an autograph. That's not an autograph. That's not an autograph. That's not an autograph. That's, I'm gonna knee slide, I'm gonna knee slide across my room if this is what I think it is. first soccer card we've had on this and this is a massive pull here i have this card at eighteen hundred dollars and this thing came out of a fat pack box I, I don't know much about it i assume it's something you can get in retail maybe not but it is a new product and it is a massive pull at number seven we're with bay area pull it's burl auto oh my god it's a burl for sure burl night i can do it Bango check. There's the bango check. I need to smoke real quick, bro. Yeah, yeah, hold on. Breathe. Be a number Breathe. one time. Breathe. Joey B L S U. Be a numbered one. Be a numbered one. Out of five, baby. Out of 75. Bang! Go. Chris, go, Joey B. Let's go! What a case again! Wow! Oh my God! I caught under seventy-five. Lucky, lucky! Let's go! What a box pick! 
It's a nice little Joe Burrow pole to start us out. There's a couple more coming. This is a nice one, though. I love this green scope parallel. I have this one at $2,000. At number six, we're with Urban Card Breaks. Oh, my goodness. We have a something. <laughs> we have something, I know, and it's not like the others. Uh-oh. Hobby just jinxed us. Oh, no. It's a first. Oh, my goodness. It's Boston. Can it be Mayor? Oh, I don't even know what the card looks like. I can't remember. Let's just do it. Ready? Oh! Holy crap! Oh, man! Holy! Are you seeing this right now? Wow! Holy crap, Fall Creek, where are you? Mother of cards. I don't want a one. It's the black border. Ray Wave Auto. Holy crap. This Marcelo Mayer guy keeps popping up and people love him. I don't know much about him, but this is a $175 Bowman Chrome Draft light box. And this card goes for about two grand. It's not a one on one. There's multiple, there's been some sales of this card around $2,000, which is why I priced it there. But it is a beautiful card. And if this guy pans out, this card could be worth a lot of money. And number five this week, we're with Retail Breaks. Oh my f God. F Sean, I'm just going to pull it out right now. I knew we were going to get something. Powder blue fucking wander out of 50. Back to back weeks of retail breaks. And this card is huge. Now I know card purchaser. If you guys are on Twitter, I'm sure you know who card purchaser is. I think he had this card on his eBay and it went up to 20K. I, I'm looked in 130point.com and I don't see an actual sale of that yet. And I don't actually see it on eBay anymore. So I don't know if I overlooked it or whatnot, but I do see there is a sale for $3,000 on eBay. That's where I have this card. Again, Wander Franco is going crazy. At number four this week, Holy we're with shit, Backyard back. Breaks. I gotta move it to the back. Holy shit, we hit it. We literally got delivered one hobby box out of the case, and we hit the case hit. Jalen Rager, Jeff Gladley. We have a Jerry Rice. We have a Demario Davis. We have a rookie stained glass. No oh. way. We have a Joey oh! Beast. That's literally it. We got delivered one box. No the way. Case hit. Box. That, that was the one, one box of Prism. Oh, oh so my God. No way. He asked the guy, was this out of a steel case? He goes, yeah, I have no idea what else. Was Holy sh**. So there's two PSA 10s that sold for $15,000 last week which is tripled what this card was worth as a PSA 10 from back in November. Raw, I'm going to have this around $3,500, but this is a beautiful card. I love this design. At number three, we're with Mamba Cards. And Isaiah Simmons, we got a red wave first. Let's do the red wave first. We'll save the color last. We'll sweat that <laughs> Sony Michelle out of 149. You guys ready? No! 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 We have back-to-back -back Joe Burrow case hits this week. These color blasts are beautiful, too. I, I, I don't know. If I have to pick between the two, that stained glass is absolutely beautiful. I might have to go with that one. But I have this one at $4,000, so valued a little more than the stained glass. Let me know what you guys. Do you guys prefer the stained glass or the color blast if you were to pick? At number two, we're with Kadu. Hey, Linda, man. Huh? Well, come look at <laughs> Oh, 
Another week, another flawless logo, man. This is another one of Pengzai, my, my dude. He hooked me up with this video. This card's tough to comp out, but looking at some of the Joker's 101s that have sold in the past, I, I think this is going to be about a $7,500 card. It is a beauty. At number one, we have on two, left, three, eight guarantee. cards. So, good luck on this. No way. What is this? It's a Steph Curry? How many diamonds is that? What in the world is this? That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 21 diamonds? Another week of flawless basketball taking down the top two spots this week. This card is massive. You know, you guys saw the, the LeBrons and I had them valued about 10K. So I was like, you know, Steph, I think Steph Curry's going to be right around there. And then I go to eBay sales and I see that the team logo gems, this is the NBA logo gems, but the team logo gems sold for $20,000. So I had to up that 10 k I'm going to go with 17500 on this one. I think that the team logo might be a little bit more sought after than the NBA logos, but I could be wrong. Either way, I just have a hard time imagining that people are going to pay that much for these cards, but they are. Let's get into some of those honorable mentions, though. These are cards that just barely missed the cut. Our first honorable mention comes from Mojo Break, and I just want to show you one of these <laughs> inserts. Damn. Home field advantage, Mike Trout. Dude. Boom, baby. Now, I think this is only like a $300 card, but this is the first time we see a downtown style insert from top. So it is pretty cool. And maybe that price fluctuates a lot. It is early, and that's just my estimate, but this is a cool-looking card. Our next one is from Heads Up Sports Cards. We have... Oh, my goodness! This is the way to start a break. One of one Super Fractor Frank Thomas on card autograph out of Allen and Ginter Chrome for the White Sox. That is sick. And that is going to D-Man. <laughs> Holy cow. D-Man live and in living color with us. One of one, Frank Thomas. No way. Fractor. No way. Are you serious? <laughs> no way. Are you shitting me? First pack. No way. First pack. Now, Alan and Genter, you know, not not everyone's top product on the list. And the boxes are like only 150 bucks. I did not realize autographs are case hits. Super Fractor autograph of a Hall of Famer. That is a massive pull. And it's pretty cool that the owner of the card who had the spot for uh, the White Sox was actually present for this live. So that was pretty cool. Now, our last honorable mention is from CBC bad. Sports Cards. I have one Burrow card. There's one Burrow card. He's going to grab. We have a gold. <laughs> this is on fire, bro. What the hell? I've seen him. Onyeke, Mason Jones. Crazy gold. Come on. Crazy gold. Give me a crazy gold for the guy. We have to end off with a bang. AD, Malachi Flynn. We got LeBron James Mosaic. Oh, Meta Mastery, Dame Time. Meta Mastery, Jaw. Oh, it's going to be a debut. Rookie. a nice little ant-man there we uh we've seen a couple sales of this card i have this one at 1500 bucks it's something to definitely get excited over which they did for sure looking at the releases for next week a couple decent products we have donruss elite basketball and panini origins basketball a couple of potential big hitters out of there but we will see what next week has in the store that's gonna do it for today's polls guys i hope you enjoyed make sure to hit that like button if you did also, I, I don't say this enough, but I know you guys see these polls, you're really jacked up. You're like, hey, I need to go spend hundreds of dollars on a hobby box so I can get on Ian's top 10 polls of the week. 
these poles are not typical guys but if you do have the spare change and you're okay with losing you know half of it I, I don't know I don't open too many of these hobby boxes so I don't know but please let me know if you do pull something awesome otherwise just have fun with the hobby whatever way you guys see fit I have fun just opening retail stuff so I know a lot of you do too but let me know what poll you guys like today if it was a reaction or a certain card I'm curious to know I hope you have a great rest of your guys' weekend. We will have a video on Monday. I have some new products coming in. I got something off Target, so excited to open that. So at the very least, there'll probably be a new product review, but if there is some mail, might be a mail day too. Who knows? We will see. You guys just have to stay tuned to find out. That'll be it though for today. Until next time, you guys be smart, be safe, and be humble. Ian out.